so excited to be with you for another Bible adventure. And I'm sure you're also very happy and excited to be with me. Wow, Bible adventure is always fun. Children, but today my backpack feels so heavy. And I don't know why it feels this heavy. But I think I'll find out. And I guess you're going to find out with me too. But remember, we've been talking about no to bad behavior. Remember again, let's do it together. No to bad behavior. And today, we're still going to have fun learning about saying no to bad behavior. Children, let's not forget to pray. Hands together. Heads bow, eyes closed. Father, in Jesus' name, we thank you for bringing us together today for another beautiful Bible adventure time. We invite you into our presence that everything we're going to learn at your feet, we're going to put into practice. We're going to be better children this week and forever in Jesus' name. Amen. Children, praise and worship. I love praise and worship. Wow. Let's do it again. Praise and worship. What an incredible God we serve.
exciting praising and worshiping God. Wow, it was really fun. Remember, I told you my back feels so heavy and I didn't remember why it was feeling that heavy. But now I know I have some stuff in here that we're going to trash. Yes, stuff in my bag that we're going to trash. Remember, we've been talking about saying no to bad behaviors. And we're going to treat them one after the other. So let's take it one after the other. Let's take the first one. Ta-da! Bullying! Say no to bullying. Can you remember? Bullying is making threats. You know, telling somebody, I'm going to beat you. Say no to it. Or telling somebody, oh, you look so fat. You look so thin. You're ugly. No, no, no. Remember calling people names? Laughing at people? Damaging properties? No. We're saying no to it. God does not like it. And if you've been doing that, we're going to stop it because we've been saying it. No to bullying. And this makes us, today, we're trashing it. Where's my trash can? Oh, this is it. So I'm trashing no to bullying. Let's check another one that we're going to trash. Another bad behavior. Say no to pet pressure. Don't do same things that your friends are doing if they are bad. Some of you, you were your friends, and maybe you're meant to take turns, or you're meant to take permission from your teachers before you play with toys, and they're like, mm, you don't need to take those permissions. You don't need to take permission from anybody. You don't need to do those things. Don't join them. God does not like it. It's called peer pressure. Just be as good as you should be. Do the right things. Always. God wants us to always do the right thing. He wants us to do things that our parents want us to do. So we're trashing it and we're saying no to bad behavior. We're saying no to peer pressure. You always be a good child you're going to be different and you're going to be a child of god so we're trashing that let's see another one wow this is fighting say no to fighting say no to fighting people fight always you want to stop comparing yourself with others Learn to do things together. Learn to play together. Learn to share your toys. Learn to play together. Don't fight. God does not want us to fight. Mommy does not like us to fight. Daddy does not like us to fight. So we we'll always say no to fighting and don't fight. So we're trashing it. Ta da! Let's take another one. Can you see this? This is good touch, bad touch. Can you remember what Auntie told us about good touch? Good touch, how those, those, we have different parts of our body, the private one and the public one. The private ones are those ones that nobody should touch except you, like where we Wee wee or where we poo poo. And for the girls, your chest area, don't allow anybody to touch it. Where you wee wee and where you poo poo, don't allow anybody to touch it. If anybody touches it, scream and report to say no to it. So we're saying no to bad touch. We have good touch, like your mommy, daddy can hug you and say thank you. Or they say, I miss you, you know, you can't, you know, you don't allow anybody to touch you in your private 
heart. Okay, so we're saying no to bad touch. And if you've been the one touching somebody in a private area, no, no, no. We're saying no to bad touch. Trash it. So this is say no to I can't. Never say I can't. God says you're strong. God says yes, you can because God is in you. You can do everything. So even when you feel that, oh, you cannot do something, just remember that you can because God is in you. God is with you. You can do everything. You can be bold. You can be courageous. You're not too small. Can you remember the story of Gideon? Gideon felt he wasn't a warrior, but God told him, yes, you can. And he did what? He won the battle. So never say you cannot. Always say, yes, you can. What? Well, trash in it. Let's pick another one. Say no to cheating. Can you remember the story of Jacob? I love the story so much. Why? Because Esau is so, was so airy and Jacob wasn't and he cheated. Jacob cheated and he wanted to be like Esau and he got Esau's blessings because he cheated and God wasn't happy with him. Although he told God later that he was sorry and God forgave him. So don't take things that don't belong to you. Don't do things to hurt others. Don't cheat and don't lie. Okay, always remember that God does not like it. Nobody wants to be cheated and don't cheat. Per adventure, you have cheated or you found yourself to be cheated on. Just always remember that cheating is a no, no. So we're going to trash it because we're saying no to cheating. Now, let's see. Do I have more? Yes. I love this topic so well. This is say no to pride. Yes, I can remember the story of King Nebuchadnezzar, how God sent him into the jungle to stay with the animals because he was proud. He wasn't humble. God wants us to always be humble. He wants us to always know that he gave us everything that we have and god always wants us to give thanks to him even when people say oh like when people tell me, when people tell me and Kemi, you're so pretty and Kemi, you're so strong i'll just say oh thank you oh god thank you for making me to be strong don't be proud like just me can do it just like king nebuchadnezzar so we're saying no to being proud so we're trashing it down there and let's see another one, the last one. Too much of everything is bad. Taking too much of everything is bad. We have to take little at a time, just like Auntie told us that we should take things, do things in moderation. Remember the other little girl that took too much of sweets and she had tummy eggs. Can you remember Noah? that took plenty of wine and he slept without his clothes and that was not good. So we should take little things, little by little, take a little at a time. Don't take too much of everything. If you take too much of things, they will be bad for you. Is that not, that is, isn't that interesting, children? As we've learned all those things and as we're saying no to them, I pray that God will help us to continue to say no to bad behavior, or say no to it, and it's only God that can help us to do this. For adventure, you found yourself doing these bad things, and you're trying to be good, you're trying to do the right thing, you don't want to cheat, you don't want to fight, you don't want to be a bully, and you're struggling with it. When you do it today, you don't, you won't do it tomorrow, and you just, you don't know what to do. Let me tell you what we'll do. We'll call, let's invite you, let's invite you to God, and God is going to be your friend. You're going to tell God, God, please, let's put our hands together and tell God, God, please say this after me. God, please 
help me to be good. Help me to say no to bad behavior. Help me not to cheat. Help me not to fight. Help me not to take too many things at a time. He always help me to be good, a good child, even in school and at home, even in my environment. I'll always be a shining star in Jesus name. Amen. Congratulations, because now I know you can always, I, I know you can always identify when it's a bad behavior and we're always going to say no to it. When you see people do it, you say, no, I'm not going to do it. Or you report anybody having those bad behavior. Children, we're not done. Remember, we have a memory verse. Are we ready? It's still the same memory verse that we've been talking about since we started the same no to bad behavior. And it's taken from the book of 1 Corinthians chapter 6 verse 19. 1 Corinthians chapter 6 verse 19. And it says, my body is a temple of the Holy Spirit. It is not my own. My body is a temple of the Holy Spirit. It is not my own. I'm sure by now you're familiar with our memory verse because we've been taking it over and over again. So always remember that when you want to, when you see things go, when you, when devil wants you to do something bad and you know you should say no to bad behavior, remember your body belongs to God and it's not yours. Wow, that was a wonderful time. But remember, we always want to have our creativity time. I love creativity time because it's always fun. And today, our creativity time, we're going to use this. We're going to learn how to sound so that we can remember those no to bad behaviors. And we're going to take them one after the other. This is, let's sound it, ba, ba, ba. Bad touch. Say no to bad touch. The next one, wow, another b. Say no to bullying. Nice. We have another one. No to cheating. Cheating. No to cheating. Oh, what the letters do we have? All the sounds. Fighting. Say no to fighting. P, 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 p. Say no to pride. P, p, p. Say no to bad pressure. So children, we've come to the end of our creativity time and that ends the Bible adventure for today. So before we go, let's not forget to pray. Hands together, eyes closed, head bowed. Father, we thank you for today's Bible adventure. We thank you because these words are going to stay with us and we're going to be doers not only hearers of your words father this week will be the best child ever will be good in school will be good at home will be wonderful children we are going to shine like stars because we know we have you in jesus name we are praying amen children we've come to the end of today's bible adventure Good to be with you. See you next time. Bye-bye.